Africa, why are you here right now at this moment? I guess you're not as dark as you're made to seem after all. You are here because only you can bring life, hope, deliverance, and dignity to your children. For centuries, you did it for others, their children, their descendants. You are here because for so long, you are made to believe that you do not deserve a seat at the table. Why not? Why not you? Your enslaved and colonized children built the table. Your rich food provided the food. You breastfed kings, queens, foreign powers. Why not you when you were there in creation? When the creator said, let there be light, he buried rich resources in you in your belly and gave you wealth beyond your wildest dreams. Well, you should be here right now, in this moment, in this time. Africa, you gave me Alfred Mangena, the first black attorney in South Africa in 1909. You gave me Pixley, Kaisa Kaseme, one of the very first lawyers, Dumanokwe, the very first black advocate and the very first president of the African National Congress. Ishmael Muhammad, the first black and post-democratic South Africa, chief justice of the newly established Constitutional Court. You gave me Yvonne Mohor, the first black female justice to be appointed in the Constitutional Court. You gave me Lucy Maulula, the first black female to be appointed in the High Court. How can I not speak about Supreme Court Judge Justice Lex Mpati, who went to a very small Catholic school in a tiny town called Fort Beaufort. You cannot point it out in the map. That's exactly where I started my schooling. How can I not mention heroes like legal counselor Nelson Mandela, Oliver Tambo, Chief Justice Mukhoeng Mukhoeng, Advocate Tulima Donzela, and many more that have carried this baton. Africa, let me introduce myself. I am Nozi Polani, and I promise you that in my lifetime, I will do my very best to ensure that quality legal services and justice is made freely accessible to the poor and marginalized in Africa. I thank you.